Shut up and sit down. Hi, welcome to Tech Talk for You. I'm Patrick, and this is Rob. This is our very first episode. It really is. He's not lying. I I can assure you of that. So forgive us if it's a little rough. Anyway, Tiny little bit. Moving on. It is uh, nice to be here with you. Actually, it's not. It's kind of chilly out. Against the long sleeves. And the smoke in the air is horrible. I'm telling you. Yeah, a lot of fires nearby. But we'll survive because that's what we do. I hope. Yeah, me too. Anyway, uh, topic of conversation for today is apple sauce. Yeah, right? No, not applesauce. Oh, God. <laughs> but uh, applesauce is good for you. I heard it's very healthy. It is. Actually, a uh, high concentration of pectin. Especially when it's homemade, right? I mean, you don't get all those artificial ingredients. flavors or ingredients in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a, good to know. That's a true story, actually. Good to know. Yeah, it cleanses the body. It's very high in fiber and pectin. I think I said pectin. Anyway, but we're not talking about applesauce. We're talking no. about Apple Computer. Recently, Computadora. See. All right. You may have recently heard, or not, that Apple Computer uh, released some new devices. The new MacBook Air, which everybody's been, oh! Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! You're kidding. It was like, this, this is the first time I'm hearing about this, too. Yeah. Just goes to show you how unprepared we are. But it's okay, true. we'll work along with it. What kind of tech show is this? It's going to get better, folks. Hopefully. Anyway, so uh, I'm a longtime Mac fan, and I have to admit I was a little disappointed. Uh, I purchased my MacBook Air in 2014, and I was super excited, really excited. And I upgraded the processor because the base processor at that time was an i5, a dual core i5. And I said, no, that's too slow. I need more power. And so I upgraded to an i7. A dual core i7. Seven. Yeah. And I upgraded the RAM to 8 gigabytes of RAM and, and, and a solid state drive with 256 gigabytes of memory. So I was so disappointed because I'd waited a long time for a refresh of the MacBook Airline. I was happy that they got one. Uh, a couple of high points were the Retina display. Uh, now it literally looks like you're looking out a window. Um, that's better than reality and uh, but the downside was it still comes with a dual core processor oh, God. and now it only comes with an i5 there is no option to upgrade I don't care how much you pay you can however upgrade the RAM to 16 gigabytes or the SSD to blah 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 well that's refreshing yeah not really what yeah that's what they yeah, call at least it. you can do something that's what they called it Anyway, come on, Apple. That's ridiculous. Dual core processor and no option to upgrade? Come on. Right. Right. Anyway. My point exactly. So you can get better hardware. You can get a lot better hardware. I think the reason why people buy Apple products, why I bought Apple products, is not because of the hardware. I mean, yeah, to an extent. They have fantastic battery life. You're not going to get that kind of battery. Well, you might, but it's unlikely. Most standard hard, uh, laptops, you're not going to get that kind of uh, battery life out of them. What you will get from an Apple product is software. Really good software. It's a whole ecosystem. Uh, that's what people buy into, in my opinion. Um, when I was doing app development, I bought my MacBook Air so that I could develop apps for iOS. You have to have... It's true again. You have to have a Mac to develop for iOS. So, I don't know. I love the iPhone, uh, simple to use. What do you think about the iPhone? I think the iPhone is great. Personally, it's something, it's like... Jello? It's so, it's like Jello, I guess. You can, you can eat it really easily. You can use the iPhone really easily. Children, I mean, it, it is what the you elderly. see. You just, basically, you just flip and click. That's all it is. It works really well. I like it. I love it. The children love it. I, I'm happy. He has like 20 kids too, so he would know. 21, dude. Oh my gosh, that's so wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, anyway, I only have two, but they're good. They're good kids. Good enough. Yeah. Do they have iPhones? No, they do not. But maybe someday. Depends on how good they are. Anyway, thanks for joining us. As you can probably tell, this show is going to be a commentary on technology. All kinds of technology. We'll try to make it as entertaining, exactly. as, entertaining as we can. Yes. We're going to talk about cool things like 
technology and tractors, technology and the workplace. The food industry? The food industry. <laughs> That's a good one. That's all I can think about. Man. No, I'm just kidding. I'm actually working on losing some weight myself, so. Aren't we all? New Year's is right around the corner. It's last Thanksgiving. Oh, Christmas. Good. Yes. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next Thank time. Thank you, folks. Have a good evening. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.